In this video, despite the manipulation in Bitcoin, I'm going to share with you a few reasons why you shouldn't be afraid of what is going on in the cryptocurrency market. Also, in this video, we'll be looking at the cryptocurrency fear and greed index to help understand the general sentiment in the cryptocurrency market. With that, we'll also be looking at the global cryptocurrency market capitalization to see how the cryptocurrency ecosystem is holding up. This video will not be complete without doing a technical analysis on the cryptocurrency project Cosmos Network to see where the price goes in the immediate short term. If you would like to know what the motivational quote is for today, you definitely need to watch this video to the very end. That being said, my name is Enes Cosmic and welcome to Finance Your Independence. If you are new to this channel, be sure to subscribe and hit the bell notification button to be notified each time we post a new video. Also understand that Anything said in this video shouldn't be considered as financial advice. Be sure to do your own research before investing any of your hard earned money into a volatile cryptocurrency market. All right, let's get it. So this past few days has been nerve wracking for a lot of people in the cryptocurrency space. The reason for that is there is so much manipulation going on in the price of Bitcoin, which is affecting altcoins as well. The reason why the movement in price in Bitcoin affects altcoins is that Bitcoin is a reserve currency of the cryptocurrency space. So if there is bullish sentiments around Bitcoin, there is going to be bullish sentiments around altcoins. If there is bearish sentiments around Bitcoin, it's going to bring about bearish sentiments around altcoins. However, we are at a stage in the bull run where we're going to see altcoins decouple from Bitcoin, meaning that whatever is going on with the price of Bitcoin is not necessarily going to affect all altcoins. A typical example is Cardano. During the Bitcoin flash crash a couple of days ago, Cardano kept rallying up, currently trading over $2 per token. So even though Bitcoin is tied to the rest of the market, going forward, we're going to start seeing individual altcoins separate themselves from the Bitcoin dominance. For those of you listening to me right now, this is the time you need to position yourself to make ridiculous gains in cryptocurrency. This is not a time to be speculating on projects without any fundamentals. A lot of projects in the cryptocurrency space are still working on their white paper. They don't really have a working product. If you really want to make life-changing gains in cryptocurrency, this is the point in the bull run to stop speculating. Invest your hard-earned money into projects with great fundamentals. The reason for that is nobody knows when exactly this bull run is going to be over. And when this thing is all said and done, you don't want to be holding onto a coin without any fundamentals because those tokens are going to correct 90 to 95%. This bull run we have is different from the one we experienced in 2017. The reason for that is the bear market we're going to experience this time, projects with great fundamentals are going to continue to rally. You don't want to be chasing a little bit of gains here and there and miss out on a life-changing opportunity. Set it and live it and allow time to do the heavy lifting for you. All right, let's go ahead and look at the cryptocurrency fear and greed index to help understand the general sentiment in the cryptocurrency ecosystem. So over here, I'm on the official website for cryptocurrency fear and greed index. And as you can see right here, yesterday, we recorded 26, which was fear. Today, that number is 27, which is also fear. One thing you have to understand about the cryptocurrency fear and greed index is that whenever this number is very close to 100, it means investors are extremely greedy, which is an indication that the market is due for a correction. Whenever this number is very close to zero, it means investors are extremely fearful, which provides you and I the opportunity to buy the dip. Some fear is always good for the cryptocurrency market because it prevents the market from overheating and also gives you and I the opportunity to buy the dip. Let's go ahead to CoinMarketCap to see what else is going on in the cryptocurrency ecosystem. Over here, I'm on the official website for CoinMarketCap. And as you can see right here, the global cryptocurrency market capitalization is now sitting at 2.29 trillion US dollars, which is a 0.88% decrease over the last 24 hours. Looking at the 10 largest cryptocurrencies by market cap, Bitcoin is down 2.9%, Ethereum is down 2.3%, Binance Coin is down 2.7%, Cardano is up 18%, Dogecoin is down 0.24%, Terra is Tether, XRP is down 2.3%, Polkadot is up 13%, Internet Computer ICP is down 12.6%, and Bitcoin Cash is down 5.3%. Overall, the cryptocurrency ecosystem is holding up, and while it may look like a lot of altcoins are in the red, some altcoins are doing better than others. Like I said, this is not a time to play around. This is the time for you to focus and make the best out of this opportunity we've been given. All right, 
let's go ahead and do some technical analysis. So over here, I'm on the one hour chart for Atom, which happens to be the utility token for Cosmos Network. As you can see right now, this token is trading at $28.05. We were able to break this resistance level of $24.60, and we also successfully retested this level of $25.43. Currently, we are trading above this rectangle right here, which is great to see. The question is, where do we go from here? Let's head over to the four hour chart to see what else is going on. So over here, I'm on the four hour chart for Atom. And as you can see, we successfully broke this resistance level of $24.15. And currently, there is no major resistance in our way until we get to $32.25. If we happen to successfully retest this level of $32.25, the sky will be the limit for the price of Atom. Because like I keep saying in all my videos, Cosmos Atom is grossly undervalued. If you look at their closest competitor, which is Polkadot, they already have over 43 billion US dollars in market cap. Atom only have a little bit above 5 billion US dollars in market cap. In terms of digital assets under management, Atom is way ahead of Polkadot. Polkadot hasn't even released one parachain on mainnet and they are worth over 42 billion US dollars. So when I'm telling you this project is grossly undervalued, I'm not saying this because it's fun to say, I'm saying it because that is the fact. It's just a matter of time we're gonna see a parabolic move in the price of Atom, and anyone who is not confident about this project is not ready for what is coming. When we talk about interoperability, which allows blockchains to talk to each other, nobody does it better than Cosmos Network. They have so many things they are working on right now that's going to bring more utility to the Atom token. So if you are not already invested in this project, this is the best time for you to consider allocating some of your money to Cosmos Atom. Because this project is going to shock your eyeballs. It's just a matter of time. So there you have it. What do you think about the fear, uncertainty, and doubt in the cryptocurrency ecosystem? Leave your feedback in the comment section below. Before you go, here is a motivational quote to consider. Work for a cause, not for applause. Live life to express, not to impress. That's all I have for you for today. My name is Enes Cosmic. See you on the next one. If you've gained some value from this video, please smash the like button and share this video with your friends. If you are new to this channel, please subscribe and hit the bell notification button to be notified each time we post a new video. That's all I have for you for today. My name is Enes Cosmic. Thank you for watching.